You ever ask yourself like, why in the hell will I take out a loan to pay off other loans? Debt consolidation loans, right? Are they a good thing? Are they a good thing? I, think about it. You're taking out a loan to pay off all the loans. And probably from my body language and the way I'm actually cueing it to you, you're like, he's probably going to say it's not a good idea. Well, it depends. First and foremost, it depends on the person. Let's just get that out of the way because some of you will do a great thing, get a great buy on a loan, okay? You will get a great loan, low interest rate, pay up all your debt, then pay that debt off, then go back into debt. Now, of course, this is what I call financial insanity because in order to change your methods, in order to change your behavior, you have to understand how did you get into that trend? How did you get into that mindset of getting yourself in debt, but now you need to go and secure another debt to pay off another debt? Debt consolidation is not for everyone. So when is debt consolidation a great thing? When is it great to go and get a loan to pay off other loans? Have I ever used it? No, fortunately. But I know that many of people have used debt consolidation to get themselves back on their feet and for some, back off their feet, right? It puts some people back thousands of dollars, if not hundreds of thousands, I hope not, okay? But this is the thing. If you have a multitude of loans and you add up the interest rates and you add up the amount of time that you have to pay it off, if you can find a debt consolidation loan, take for instance, your debt consolidation loan is 20%, but all of your loans put together is 30%, what should you actually do? Now, it has to do with a lot. It has to do with if there are any penalties with your debt consolidation loan. Is there a payoff early fee? Because a lot of times in the fine print, the fine writing, right? They like to try to catch you like, oh, if you pay off, there's a penalty because they don't really want you to pay it off sooner because they want you to pay the interest, okay? They want you to pay the interest, but you're trying to get out of debt as soon as possible at a lower interest rate in a less of time. Because this is the thing, even if that debt consolidation loan is 20% and is double the time of your other debts that equal 30%, how much percent are you paying for that loan? You're paying 40%. So yeah, it may look good at 20%, but you're gonna pay double because it's double the amount of time that you have with your other loans. And you're saying, well, hey, I'll just pay more. That is when you have to look in the fine print. Now, I don't know how many financial institutions there are out there, but let me tell you, their number one goal is what? Making money. That's their number one rule. That's their number one goal. That's their number one mission is to make them more money. Not you, okay? They could be helping you out. So these are key factors. You don't need to take all day. Some people want you to actually go down and list every single thing. But to generalize this, and I know it's quite vague, that's okay, but I'm giving you the meat and potatoes for you to understand when is debt consolidation loan good? Because you also have to factor in is when you take out that loan, okay? First and foremost, you gotta have decent credit. If you have horrible credit, anything like under a 720 or 700, you're gonna get horrible rates anyway, it's gonna be high, but it still may be better than the accumulation of interest and loans that you have that you're trying to pay off. But this is the thing, it's another ding on your credit. Your credit score is gonna go down because now you have another loan, then you have to pay off those loans unless, because when you go, they're gonna check your credit. When you go apply for it, it's gonna check your credit, it's gonna hit your credit, and then it's gonna take time for your other loans to be taken off, maybe a month or so, and then your credit score will jump back up. So these are things to actually factor in when you're looking at debt consolidation loans. Am I saying they're a bad thing? Eh. Am I saying they're a good thing? It just depends on you. The factors I listed here are basic and simple. How, how many loans do you have? What's the amount? How long do you have to take it off? read the fine print. Then you should know if debt consolidation loans are for you. This is Ross World where I just, I scratch my head, I wipe my face. I'm just trying to figure out, is it the right thing? Am I the right person to do it? Am I gonna get back in debt? 
Is this gonna hurt my credit? These are some questions you really need to ask yourself. I'm out.